Uh, kids involved in mainly hands-on activities, spray painting, tie-dyeing, uh, cutting, painting, you name it, we have it here. We noticed that there are some bags. Tell us about those bags. All right, the um, bags are decorated by the campers. We use stencils, paint to decorate these bags. The bags are perfect for market use, you know. Take them to the market instead of using um, plastic bags. We recycle, we, do, we have new things instead of, you know, having plastic bags thrown all over the place. So the, the bags are perfect. We notice there are a lot of kids here. What are, what are the numbers and how long is this camp going to last? Oh, well, this camp begin on, uh, began on Monday. On Monday, the 1st of July. We will finish up uh, on Friday. Uh, we have like over 100 campers presently. Wow. Every year the number keeps rising or? Keep going up. Keep going up. We have so far, the biggest crowd we had was like 145 campers. All right. So how, how did this initiative came about and who made it possible? Well, this started off with Miss Julie Poonert. Um, she is originally from uh, in St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, we start off with like, say, 75 campers in Parish Hall. Um, after they left to go back to the States, I take it over. Um, this is our eighth year. At this point, I would like to thank the parents, first of all, to trust trust us with their children. We have, I mean, a lot of children on Kompong and we need to get the parents' uh, participation and involvement. I would like to also thank uh, my volunteers, my teachers' volunteers from, um, from Punta Gorda. We also have a group of six who come from the United States, St. Louis and Missouri. I would also like to thank BTL, BTL for their sponsorship to make this camp possible. We also spoke to founder Julie Kooner, who gave her impressions. We, I brought five volunteers with me for six of us. We are from the States, from St. Louis, Missouri, and I come down here and I help Faye every single year. This is our eighth year of camp, and it is one of the largest camps in the area, and we have over 100 students. We do art projects with them. We have a lot of fun. We do games. It's a good time. All right. So far, how has the other team members been like? They, how did, is this some of their first time being here? Yes. I only I have one teacher that is an art teacher in the states that she. This is her second time coming, but um, we have three students that are in high school that are with us for service hours and. A co-worker of mine from preschool, preschool teacher. And overall, from all the years you've been here, how has it been personally for you? Oh, it's been great. I, I lived here a long time ago and started the camp then, and so I love coming back because it really does feel like a home away from home.